Now, um, we have a guest tonight, but he's not here yet. He'll be here soon. Okay. But I wanted to start the podcast a little earlier because I wanted to address something. Last week was a very um, difficult time for Tiger Belly. Um, we had we were on the front page of Pray. Reddit. Reddit. Page. We we're at the first page of Reddit, <laughs> and we were also on the Chive and and um, Damn. and basically what it was was um, people were lynching my beautiful girlfriend Kalila Coloco, as you know. Damn. They were saying that she, um, number one, she's not my wife. <laughs> Get that shit right. Get that, that shit, shit right. fucking right, no. right now. She's my fucking girlfriend. And if I was. All right. And, and if that's I... the only thing, that was my only complaint that's about the whole it. thing. Let's move on. Let's move on. <laughs> Is, um, so I just wanted to address that part. Which makes me a real life. <laughs> Which makes me a non-skillful gold digger. If I've been with you for five years yeah. and I don't have a ring on my finger, yeah. I am the worst gold digger. So basically, in what it was was they um, they took a little tiny clip of a mm -hmm. podcast we did a long time ago, and basically, Kalila saying, "Well, what kind of if you're poor, what kind of money are you gonna throw at my tears?" Is basically what it was, right? Yeah. But it was, but the context of it was taken out of place because of the fact that we were talking about. You after surgery, how I wasn't emotionally available, mm -hmm. and um, let me just say this, and, and and you can ask any girlfriend that I've ever been with, it's a fucking nightmare to date me. All right, if it was just right, it's it's an absolute nightmare. I mean, just it's, admit it. <laughs> Someone say something. It's a right. nightmare. It's a, it's a fucking nightmare. All right. You want someone to I smell. Yeah. I have fucked up feet. I have I have poor social, uh, you know, behaviors out there. Uh -huh. I have bad hygiene. I'm I'm just disgusting. I fart every ten seconds. I um I'm just I I'm dumb. I don't listen. I don't know much about anything. And um I'm I don't cuddle. I'm not caring. <laughs> It's a, it's it's a, I'm a difficult person to date, okay? And I'm telling you right now that Kalila, I don't know what it is, but there's something about me that she loves and that's what she's in it for. She's not in it for anything else. I'm telling you right now. In fact, she doesn't have a fucking car. Right? She has no fucking car this bitch. <laughs> All right. What? Uh, just let me just talk. That's a choice. I understand that, but that's an. That's I understand an that, but it's like you don't environmentally conscious choice. I had a car when I met you, yeah, and I truck. got rid of it. I had a truck. The yeah. worst kind of car. Yeah, and I was like, she doesn't Wait. get anything from the relationship. All right, she gets she loses, food. She loses. She's, she's, she's losing in life. She's losing her soul. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, five years wasted, really. <laughs> Five years of her life wasted. <laughs> if but, you, okay, if you think about where I was before I met you, I had, you know, a middle class life, right? Yeah. I had a home by the beach making, I mean, a job. What, 80K a year maybe might not be a lot to people, but that's enough for a single person like myself. Yeah. Um, I... I had a nice life. I have, you know, a college degree. I had pets, good family, good friends, a nice life. Yeah. And then, and, and a car, even two bicycles, a skateboard. Now you're I don't have any of that. Now you're showing off. Now you're showing off. And <laughs> then she has to let my gray, dead alien dick <laughs> enter. into her vagina. And that right there is. You know, I've had to pay prostitutes more money because they saw my dick and they said, no way. No way. No, thank you, sir. Triple. All right. I'm just not a catch, you know, and it's kind of a nightmare for her. Oh. It's so, not a nightmare for so me. I know there's love, but my point is, is this. Let me just say this last thing is, is that I didn't even want to fucking address it because it's so dumb that that's even out there. And at the end of the day. I know that you suffered greatly. It's, it was a terrible thing. I felt really bad about it. People, you know, came to our defense. Thank mm -hmm. you. Yeah. Um, Tiger Belly fans came to our defense. Thank you. But at the end of the day, and you're going to hate to hear this, it's, it's going to pass. I know that. It's going to pass. And, you know, the reason why people are talking about it 
at the end of the day, it's because we're on the fucking map. Boom. And it's hard to say that. It almost felt like a personal vendetta, though. There was, uh, we, there, the we, there's tone. a list of people. I know it could have been. We have a short list of people. You yeah. guys are good at doing that. Figuring out who it is. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But As it, a matter of fact, I'll give you any Tiger Belly listener $2,000 of my own what? money if you find the IP address of this person. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah. she got Not money. Not his money, yeah, my her money, money. Her money. And if you're able to prove that it's this person who started it, I'll give you 2 k of my own money. I already money. know who you're talking about. Baby, just from your baby, face. Now, just from your face, baby, I know who you're talking it's about. It's getting fucking crazy. <laughs> it's getting ridiculous. <laughs> it's interesting. It's ridi- and it is, no, it's not interesting. What are you going to do, Wrath? No, not what, Wrath. What happens if you find the name? I want that person to be on our podcast. Oh, oh so you want... Ah, uh, Okay. I mean, there's a five. There's a list. What, what, what's the 2004 specifically? I'm waiting Find for the IP address to match it with who uh, I what, think uh, they. Th- the YouTube. Uh, person, the original. The person p- who posts the original. E- okay, so there's the original. I think that the original version. Yes. Yeah, so let me yeah, let me get this it. clear. Who posted it on Reddit with that title? Okay. Yes. That's who we need. Okay. But it's it's one of five names. That's good that you narrowed it down. Okay, and uh, no, I don't think that it's that. I think it was probably just a fucking Cheeto fingered, little dick, fucking dude. Well, there we go. There's a rat. Like, There's the, the anger. House. There's the anger. But I mean, I think okay. <laughs> There's a resentment. When in the history of anything other than like Vice, have have is has there ever been an, a true interview of a Cheeto fingered troll? Right. Like, I think that's pretty interesting. Like, hey, what do you do all day? Why the hate? Why this? But it's not just that. It's like what this Cheeto fingered. I don't know what Cheeto fingered means. <laughs> I mean, Somebody they, eats a lot of Cheetos. Cheetos well, I'm Cheeto fingered. I love Cheetos. <laughs> yeah. You know what? I'm Cheeto yeah, fingered yeah. too. What the fuck? I love Cheetos. <laughs> yeah. Is he with Trump? Is he Cheeto fingered? He's very Cheeto fingered. Yeah. I have a theory about the whole thing. Um, I also think that if you were a white man, that this wouldn't be... Um, I, single. I, I don't think that this video would have been pulled out with such like interest from the public. Right, okay, so here's the theory. The theory is this: is that because um, we we have contact, we have rich, we know a rich Asian dude that's married to a beautiful white lady, mm-hmm. and his email to us was basically, "It's a white dude that did it to desexualize me." It's not Whoa. just one Asian dude who wrote me. There's actually a lot of like Asian men Look at who George. wrote me. Look at George. He's upset. Did you, did you post was... it? George, you did. You posted it for the views. <laughs> what? You, you threatened by me? You fucking asshole. Yeah, you fucking cop. How dare you desexualize our captain? You think shaving your beard? <laughs> you think shaving your beard? We know who you are, dude, and what you look like. <laughs> what you look like? You look foolish. Clean shaven, by the way. <laughs> foolish. Grow that beard pronto. It looks gross. <laughs> You had a chance. No. Now, no chance. At what? Pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that face. Yuck. So smooth. <laughs> and also people, and, people. Also people. People. When you come to my show, just in El Paso, just want to say this: don't go to the don't go to the bodyguard or the doorman. Go. George has a pink dick. That's so weird. To that's, a, that's not that's not a code to get back to see me. <laughs> Freaks them out. They, the body or the the bouncers don't know that code. They haven't they don't been know, like pre. They're not pre. Yeah. So when you just randomly walk up to a big guy at a club and go, "Hey, is George has a pink dick?" They don't have the context of. So they think that either you, you know what I mean. They know a guy named George. <laughs> You're like what? Like yeah. they, in the role of they're probably. Do I know a George? <laughs> or it's gay. It's a little like you're hitting on me. Yeah. You know. So just don't do that. That's weird. Yeah. Um, but I'm sorry that you went through that, babe. It's okay. To 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 wrap this up nicely, to get the funny stuff out the way first. But on a serious note, I always appreciated our fan base. Always, always. I always know that you guys are there through our ups and downs. But I was never. I've never been able to appreciate them as much as I do now because of all of this. Yeah. There's. I've had so much support male female and mm. it made me want to get to know all of you even more i've never oh, felt fuck. so much love or there it is you know <laughs> there, just there it is affirmation there, there it is. emotion and also so thank you. and also it's like on um, this if you try to desexualize papa <laughs> you know, can't do it you can't do it <laughs> it's like trying to unspiritualize the lord wow yeah. wow okay? the lord is sp- pure spirit and I'm pure, pure sex. 
<laughs> all right. Who else comes up with terms like nos, nos, nosotros papá or no one. science alert? Nobody. Or, yeah, nobody. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, that what's up. Mm -hmm. Who else can go into Urban Bob? No one. No one. Okay. I'm pure sex. You know, I, I, I let me just say something right now, guys. Um, I know how sexy I am, man. I look in the mirror, dude, mm -hmm. and I fucking, I get half hard, dude. Get half chub? Yeah, man. Damn. That's, wow. Look at my fucking Instagram, me on top of the mountain. That's the king and I. Is that not right? That is so right. So now Oliver's coming. So, but we, we got that out of the way. But thank you so much, Tiger mm -hmm. Belly fans. Um, we love you so much. And we are going to find this fucking cocksucker that did this. And we will find him. It's going to be a war. <laughs> Against like a 14-year-old. No, I, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Two thousand right, dollars. Orange finger, right? Cheeto. What orange is that? fingers. Cheeto fingered. We're gonna get it. Yeah, him. and for the record, I've had two abortions. If I wanted to trap him, I would have kept one of those retarded babies. They're not gonna. They're not retarded. That's you're making an assumption, babe. They would have sixteen hundreds <laughs> on their SATs. Okay. Yeah. Maybe. They will. Yeah, but that's because like of just pure falling on the spectrum by Dude, accident. Uh, uh, also, manship. by the by, let's just listen to this, okay? By the by, yeah. by, the by, by. listen to this, okay? <laughs> is is that I did this to my body? Choice. All right, I look retarded by choice. When I was a baby, I was cute. All right, I and throughout my whole life, I was cute, right? And what I did was I threw garbage in, inside my body, mm -hmm. and I lived this way. Mm -hmm. Right, to look like the way I do. I like the way I look. Yeah, you eat sugar cubes. Yeah, I love sugar cubes, okay? <laughs> so I did this to myself. But if I wanted to look like Steven Yoon, God willing, <laughs> God willing, I would. Please, please, God. Please, God. Please, make it happen. Anyway, he's coming.